Hey guys, John here. Today I'm going to teach you how to make a Chinese style pluck in citrus and it sounds like this. All right, I think you get the idea. So let's start off with a default patch, but this time it's gonna be default subtractive because it has a couple things already set up for us. The first operator is going into the first filter and that's going to the output and we have a saw wave. So let's right click this first saw wave and go to convert to shape sign harmonics. So let's look at this saw wave here and let's look what's happening. So what I did is I deleted the second octave, the third octave, the fourth octave, the fifth octave, and I think the sixth octave as well. And you could hold down Alt and click these bars to remove things. Now with the skew, I brought that up to about 48% or so. The sign shaper at about 87, 88. And then the noise, maybe about 79 or 80. And that's basically going to be this wave. And I also hit pluck as well. And let's see how close we got. All right, so we're kind of close. It's a little loud, so let's bring this down here. So now let's make our volume envelope. So let's go to our volume and then our envelope. Let's turn our envelope on. Let's bring our attack kind of sharp and the sustain maybe a little bit below halfway and then you can play with the decay however you please. I think that sounds pretty good there. Now really where the magic shines is going to be in this pitch envelope here. So let's turn this pitch envelope on by clicking this little button. Let's select our pencil tool and hold right click and delete all this. We don't need any of that. Unclick your pencil and grab this little node here. Bring this up maybe a little over halfway. Right click here on the next line here and let's see what happens. So that's the effect that we want, but we just have to change the strength. And this is where this pitch envelope knob here comes in really handy. So that still might be a little too much. So if that's the case, let's drag this little node here down right there. Maybe it's a little too much. Let's drag a little bit more down. All right, that sounds pretty good. So now the rest of it is going to be in the effects. So what I did is I used one delay, turn that on, and then I did the feedback, maybe a little 55, 56, not too much. I changed the time to four and then boosted up the volume a little bit more. And then I also hit serial. So it gets fed into the reverb and we turn that on as well. And let's see how close we got here. Maybe that pitch is a little too much here. So let's dial that down just a little bit more. Make it happen a little bit quicker. And the last thing, let's drop this down one octave because that's what we had before. And that's pretty much this patch in a nutshell. The reverb and the delay really dial in as, as well as the, uh, the pitch envelope. Also, you do want to play in a pentatonic scale because that's really the notes that you're going to hear or that your ears want to hear. So, yeah, that's this patch in a nutshell. Hopefully you learned something and we'll see you in the next one.